A East Texas family facing tragedy this day after a boater at Lake Palestine hit and killed their 14 year old son Sunday night, then left the scene. KDK's Annalise Cobo right now joining us live in studio with more on how the suspect was found and then arrested. The boater was not alone when he reportedly hit the Tyler ISD student. Just before 9 o'clock last night, game wardens got a call about a boat that crashed into a pier at the Lakeway Harbor boat ramp on Lake Palestine, injuring a young man. When they got there, they found out the boy had been killed. According to a GoFundMe page set up by the family, he is Roberto Carlos Bermejo Hernandez. The driver of the boat and at least three passengers left the scene and failed to render any aid to the teenager. We, we notified the media outlets that we were looking for a hit and run situation uh, that spurred some conversations among the people that were involved in the incident and uh, one of the parties came to us and notified that they had been involved and that the operator had fleed the scene. Jeffrey Joe Hampton of Flint was arrested Monday morning in connection with the crash. He is currently being charged with manslaughter. Hampton has previous arrests in Smith County, including two driving while intoxicated charges back in 2008. You found obviously his history, so history is the best indicator of the future. Uh, we have reason to believe that there, there was alcohol involved. Um, we have evidence that leads us to believe that may have been the case. The GoFundMe page for Hernandez indicates that he may have died saving his three-year-old sister's life. Live in the studio, Annalise Coble, KETK News. You know